The world of politics and the political ticket now. The efforts by leader of the Vision Guyana movement, Peter Ramsarup, to form a broad opposition coalition for the upcoming elections. Ramsarup is confident that the coalition could work. There has been talk of a coalition for months by the other opposition parties, but no firm decision has been made just yet. But Ramsarup is forging on, hoping that one could be formed and he could play a part in it. He believes that there are several serious issues that ought to be addressed by any new government. Guyana needs a radical transformation. We're, for example, the LCDS. One of the big things we will do is review that process. We're selling our country out for cheap. That money is coming into hands of wicked politicians. Instead of, for example, Norway um, giving us $30 million, we should ask Norway to come and build ships in our country. So 10, 20, 30,000 of us will have jobs. Teach us how to build ships. That is much better than giving us 30 million that disappears. Instead of telling an Amerindian person in the interior, you know, here's some dollars, go play with it. Why not let's teach them to fish? Let's teach them how to do, how to become a market of export where we can have the best fish in, in North America or Brazil, wherever we export that to. Those are the type of programs you will see a government of, of us putting together. Rams Rupin intends to focus a lot of his attention on rallying young supporters and getting out the vote. And what we want is to make sure we get the people. We're fighting for basic things, fat, re fat reduction, uh, more income. You know, I, I tell businessmen in, in, on Regent Street, for example, you know, when your store was just a one story, you paid that store worker 30000 or 28000 It's now five stories or six stories or four stories, but you still pay them the same 30000 Let's learn to, to create career paths. And let's move towards that direction for a better economy. And that's where our program lies, is, is, is simple programs that our people are asking for. The 2011 elections could see a record number of political parties taking on the incumbent PPP. The PPP is confident of another victory and is currently in the process of choosing its presidential candidate. The opposition PNC also believes it could form the next government, but it too also finds itself dealing with the process of choosing a presidential candidate. The Alliance for Change, on the other hand, chose its presidential candidate, Kamaraj Ramjitan, over the past weekend.